I've always known that I wanted to be a musician. I went to the market with my mom when I was four and there were two violinists playing and I just said to my mom, Mom, I really want to play the violin. My experience here at Lurie is really positive. I loved the academic classes and musical skills. I had some really great professors, so it was really wonderful. Where would I be today without music? Our program is designed that during the first year, everybody takes the same courses. The students come to our school thinking, oh, I'm going to be a music therapist, or I'm going to be a performer. Our students, when they graduate from Loria, they prove to be ready to audition for most of the master programs in the country and outside. We're educating a well-rounded musician here. We take theory classes, and in order to understand theory, you need to understand musical history. And so we take music history classes. And in order to perform, you need to understand musical skills. So we take skills classes. We're really getting a taste of every aspect of music. It's so fantastic, that relationship that we have. We're really lucky here at Laurier to have that. The performance opportunity, it's there on a weekly basis, and that's the best way to learn. I played in the orchestra and the jazz band this year. That means like seven or eight concerts in front of lots of people. You just start to learn. It's just another crowd. Many people don't realize that in a music faculty, the students come on a weekly basis for private lessons. And a lot of times your professors aren't changing, so he or she really gets to see me grow and learn my strengths and my weaknesses. We're paired with an accompanist. They're professionally trained and hired by the university, and they're always there for you. Every single week for four years you're seeing them. It's really vital to make that connection. I'm currently completing a master's degree at the Conservatory of Palermo. I'm living in Rome. Through music, I've been able to meet so many wonderful people and to see lots of wonderful things. Without that, I wouldn't have had any of those experiences.